Good evening. Chicago police say that the alleged four-man crew pulled off at least four armed robberies here on the north side Monday, beginning in Budlong Woods before crashing what detectives say was a stolen vehicle into the back of a streets and sanitation truck. They're a threat to this community. They're a threat to our officer's safety. Chicago Police Superintendent David Brown describing newly charged suspects Marcus Carter, Marcello Hicks, Marquise Green, and Deshaun McGraw, all adults ages 19 to 21. These are dangerous people, and they need to be held till trial. <laughs> The suspects, said to be armed, taken into custody Monday in this Lincoln Square garage where they hid from police, detectives say, after crashing a stolen SUV into the back of a streets and sanitation truck bursting into flames. Each of these offenders is charged with four felony counts of armed robbery with a firearm. Along with four more counts of aggravated robbery and other charges, Carter and Hicks, according to investigators, with outstanding warrants. Chicago police and tactical units from the 12th, 19th, 20th, and 24th districts winning praise for the arrest without firing a single shot. Give them credit for their hard, hard, dedicated, courageous, brave work. We were in the right place at the right time. The break in the case after officers spotted the alleged armed robbers Monday morning in the hours after they pulled this heist off on the 2400 block of Berwyn Avenue. We actually on view a potential robbery and that's what started the pursuit that led to uh, the apprehension of these offenders. The rash of armed robberies in recent weeks across the city, a daunting challenge for Chicago police. They're traveling at a high rate of speed. They flee all the time. They're armed with weapons. It's a dangerous situation for the public. It's dangerous for our officers. This could be just the beginning. Chicago police detectives say that they believe that the men are responsible for other armed robberies. You may remember earlier this week, police putting out a community alert about 50 armed robberies that took place over a four-day period. On the far north side, Julian Cruz, WGN News.